Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Heartbreak. Police officer just lost his life after illegal alien shot him to death. Illegal immigration is a hot button issue that has caused immense controversy in this country, especially in recent months. However, this latest development will have Americans of all stripes and colors saddened and coming together. After an illegal alien was released and set free he killed a police officer in the line of duty in Florida while in the process of being pursued. Now an entire community is mourning the loss of one of their brothers in blue. 100% fed up reported. We've been praying for the Florida police officer shot last week but it's just being reported that he passed away tonight. This is another heartbreaking crime that could have been 100% prevented. The man who shot officer Adam Jobbers Miller, pictured on the left below should have been tagged in 2011 and turned over to ICE. This is horrible. The Fort Myers Police Department released the following statement, It is with a heavy heart that we inform our community that Fort Myers Police Officer Adam Jobbers Miller has passed away as a result of the injuries sustained on Saturday, July 21. We ask that you continue to pray for Officer Jobbers Miller's family, friends and our entire Fort Myers Police Department family. Please pray for the family of this hero police officer, pictured below on the right and give to the GoFundMe, link below, if you can. A GoFundMe page has been set up for the officer and is almost at the goal. Here's the link to donate, Officer Adam Jobbers Miller Fund. Build the wall. This crime was 100% preventable. This thug should have never been in America. As President Trump said long ago, the illegals coming over the border aren't the best and brightest. It's shameful that illegal aliens are being deported and then coming back to America to commit crimes. The case below is a perfect example, not the best and brightest, Haitian illegal wisner Desmerit should have been turned over to ICE way back in 2011. Criminal illegal aliens have been able to come across and then go back to Mexico over and over. It's sickening. What's even more sickening is that Democrats want this. They've been pushing for open borders for votes and cheap labor. The Republicans aren't innocent either. The Chamber of Commerce has been pushing for the cheap labor at the expense of legal American citizens. The only one putting America first is President Trump. Build the wall. This is the latest case of murder at the hands of a repeat border crosser and an illegal alien criminal. Heartbreaking crimes like the case in Fort Myers, Florida would never happen if we had closed borders. Officer Jobbers Miller was shot by an illegal who had previously committed crimes and was also previously deported. What wasn't done that should have been to keep this from happening? He should have been turned over to ICE in 2011 after his first arrest but wasn't. As a result, he has arrested many times and now the latest crime he's just committed of shooting a cop. Fox News reported. The Fort Myers Police Department released a statement announcing the death of Officer Adam Jobbers Miller, 29. It is with a heavy heart that we inform our community that Fort Myers Police Officer Adam Jobbers Miller has passed away as a result of the injuries sustained on Saturday, July 21, the statement said. We ask that you continue to pray for Officer Jobbers Miller's family, friends and our entire Fort Myers Police Department family. Jobbers Miller, who police previously said had been on the force since September 2015, was injured while reporting to a Marathon gas station in Fort Myers around 7.30 p.m. on July 21 when a shooter opened fire. Following the encounter, Jobbers Miller was rushed to a hospital by another officer, where he had an emergency operation, police said. They added that after the surgery, his condition was listed as critical but stable. The suspect was taken into police custody, police said. Words cannot express the emotions running through the Fort Myers police family at this time, Chief of Police Derek Diggs said in a news release at the time of the shooting. Following the news, Saturday of Jobbers Miller's passing, Lee County Under Sheriff Carmen Marcino described the officer in a Facebook post as a true hero to us all and said words cannot capture how we feel, but together we will all help each other during this time of need. The United States is a nation of immigrants. Everyone's relatives or ancestors once came from somewhere else unless they were Native American. Nobody has a problem with legal immigration, it is a foundational principle of our country. What conservatives take umbrage with is that fact that illegal immigration is being allowed and even incentivized. Americans take great issue with illegal immigration, crossing the border, and gaming the system. If someone wants to come here, so be it, but they need to go through legal channels. By ensuring only legal immigration come to the United States tragic and senseless crimes such as these can be prevented and communities will not have to mourn the loss of their beloved men in blue. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. Thank you.